But let's give God a praise and a hand clap as the performing arts ministry brings to you, Were You There?
thy mother. You there? far beyond my understanding, far beyond. A crown of thorns, speared in his side, nailed. Why? And between two thieves, such a loving soul crucified. I could never imagine a death like that for him, ever. Never have I seen such cruel and hateful people. <laughs> I wanted to do something. At least we were there. But besides John, where were the other disciples? The crowd was so massive, I did not see any of the other disciples. Just John. And us. Peter? I, I heard. We, we were wondering if you No! I was not at the cross. I was not at the cross. I just cannot believe they took him and let Barabbas Even go. Pontius Pilate, our governor, washed his hands and said Jesus was innocent. But those jeering people wanted him crucified. But I thought they loved him. They did. But they turned on him because of Caiaphas. For 18 years he reigned as high priest of the temple, but he, he was threatened by Jesus. He used his power to convince the people that he blasphemed against God and the people. It, it makes no sense. It's so, so unjust. Yes. Yes, it was. Thomas, were you there? No. No, I was not. I was not either. 
But before he was crucified, I was in the courtyard, a, a distance away following Jesus. I, I was trying to gather information about the trial. And this woman, she started screaming at me, you were there with Jesus of Galilee. And I told her, I don't know what no, you're saying. No, no, you're not saying a woman y it was scared you? Not a woman that she scared me. Wait, wait, you here, have to understand. Just the other day, you tried to decapitate a man. I was afraid for my life. no other sensible reason other than my selfishness of why I would deny Jesus. Even when I was questioned twice more, twice more, yes, by two others, I was caught off guard. I denied knowing Jesus. I denied him. As he said I would. But Peter, I thought you loved, loved him. I did love him. Like no other, I, I did. You denied him to protect yourself. But even with all I learned through his teachings about faith and all the miracles he performed right before my eyes, I had doubt. And I still do. Doubt? Thomas. Yes, yes. You saw him raise our brother Lazarus from the grave. After four days and yet you still have. Have doubt, yes. Do you believe that he can raise himself up from the grave? What man has ever done that? How do you doubt someone whose word always comes true? I mean, he's proved himself over and over in so many ways. I just didn't understand it when he told me that this very night, before the cock crows, that I will deny him three times. <laughs> he said that to me. To me. I told him I would die before I would deny him. How did he know what I would do? I don't know, I don't know, I don't know. How did he know that Judas would betray him? He seemed to know everything. But did he know that none of his disciples besides John would be at that cross? And if he did know, and if he is everything that he says he is, then why didn't he do anything about Mother it? Mother Mary, John. God, faithful child. How he must feel. At least he has some sense of dignity. Dear God in heaven, how she must feel. I can't even begin to imagine. If it was my child, it would have never taken my life, too. I can't even think about what she must be enduring. We have a vision to hold on. We must be strong. Mary, please, is, is there anything I can do? Allow us to help in any way we can. A seat. Someone, please get a seat for her. I will, I will, right away. John, what about you? Are you all right? Is there anything that we can do for you? I keep hearing his words. Behold, thy mother. He taught us to pray, and I'm not, I'm not sure I know what to say in this moment. I know I have to be strong, but I don't think I could be as strong as he was when he said, Father, forgive them. For they know not what they do. Oh, I could never form my mouth to say those words, not after what they did. I would have fought back, cursed, and yelled at my accusers, but he, he never said a mumbling word. Nothing against the stones thrown or the spit people's mouths and the, the spear in his side. I mean, what law did, did he transgress to deserve such punishment? Where were his friends when he was taken away to be slain? What resistance did the law offer his murderers? His blood everywhere. And I followed 
his love through a crowd of hateful people with a cross he struggled with. And I couldn't do a thing for my shepherd. He fell and my heart broke. Someone helped him with a cross and it wasn't me. And my heart broke. And no matter, no matter what anyone says or does to me, from here on in, I know what I believe. And as long as there is breath in my body, follow him I just need God help me help me help me to understand help me to pray help us to pray help us Pray. We are your children. Help us know just what to say. Teach us to worship, love, and adore thee with your understanding teach us Lord teach us to pray It's a new day. We must remain faithful. Yes. Yes, Mother, we want you to know that we love Jesus so much. He was truly like no other. I was an ordinary fisherman, and he taught me to be a leader of men. He healed me of seven demons that possessed my body. It was almost as if none of us deserved him. I know I didn't. 
While others judged and ridiculed me of my unclean ways, he loved me unconditionally and made me feel whole in his presence. Whole in his presence. Oh, Mary, I do know what you mean. <laughs> Once my sister and I had this gathering at our home, right, Martha? Yes. Yes, we did, and Jesus was our guest of honor. Yes, and while I was sitting at his feet, I was so engaged in and the wisdom And while I he was, was making all the arrangements for the meal so that everyone would be fed properly. Oh, my dear sister Martha was upset with me. I was doing all the work. She wanted help with the food, but the real food was at his feet. There was so much peace and comfort next to him, I didn't dare move. So Martha, why didn't you just sit next to him? I suppose it was my pride, my pride. I just wanted everything to be right. And while I was fussing about, Jesus told me my sister made the right choice by sitting with him. It wasn't until I looked at him on the cross that I finally understood all the opportunities I missed. Man does not live by bread alone, but by every word that proceeds out of the mouth of God. I shudder to think about the stones that were going to be tossed at me, that he stopped, but that he who is without sin cast the first stone. Where would I be right now? Mother Mary. He will always be alive to me, and I have devoted my life to his ministry. Yes, my son was special. A gift of, of spirit, truth, and love. <laughs> Drawing people to him from the time he was born, everyone, including kings with gifts, came to see my sweet child in that manger. <laughs> From adoring him in my arms to this very moment, I knew that his life would be like no other. He was a gift to this world of sin and hatefulness. Way beyond what Joseph and I could ever imagine. It never crossed my mind that after... <laughs> wiping his precious little face <laughs> that I would be in a crowd of hateful people, a crowd of hateful people wiping up his blood, my son's innocent blood. Were there not mothers out there with compassion? A father. Why? Why? Why must a mother have to see her son's blood like this? This? Why? Why? Oh, God. Why? can wash away my sins, what can cover every stain, flood the darkness deep within, like healing rain, what can make the broken whole, what can set the Satisfy my soul, my deepest. 
Can wash away my sins. Nothing but the blood of Jesus. What can make me whole again? But the blood of Jesus. 
It's the third day. It's the third day. He said three days we have to go. Let's yes. go to the grave without oil. Yes, let's go. Let's go. Let's go. Come said, on. Wait, wait. Three days. Mary, three days. It's impossible for me to take all this in and accept it. Wait, I'm sorry. I mean, no disrespect. Your son did not deserve to be crucified. But what if death has taken him? Then what? Yes, I witnessed miracles. I shared in his wisdom like no other, but was our work in vain? How will people look at us? What will all our years with him have meant? Everything. Thomas, he taught us scripture. He shared endless wisdom. No one will forget the miracles. How he fed the multitudes. He gave sight to the blind. He healed the sick. He taught us to love and not to condemn. Hallelujah. Wouldn't that always mean something to you? To us. Jesus' death will not be in vain. It's difficult to see him alive after the grave, but he is alive.
Jesus is risen. He saw an angel. He saw an angel. He said that Jesus is risen. An angel? Yes. An angel? You saw You didn't see him for yourself? No. No, no, no. Unless I can see the holes in his hands. I saw him. I saw him. Celebrate our King. He is alive. He is not dead. Say glory.